Hey, players, y'all know what tomorrow is. It's November 8th. Y'all need to make sure y'all rock that vote if you have not voted early. Now, in Georgia, they have shown up in record numbers to vote early. Baby, it's been like 2020 all over again. I am so, so proud of them. But now we have a situation when it comes down to the absentee ballots, baby. So civil rights organizations have sued over a thousand unsent absentee ballots in the Atlanta area county. So the ACLU and the Southern Poverty Law Center filed a lawsuit on Sunday urging an extension of the absentee ballot deadline for roughly a thousand voters in Cobb County. So Cobb County election officials announced on Friday that 1,046 requested absentee ballots were never mailed. Now the officials claimed that the county overnighted the ballots in the mail to those in the group with out-of-state addresses while instructing the hundreds of others that they must vote in person on Thursday. Cobb County Elections and Registration Director Janine Eveler said in a message that many of the absentee staff have been averaging 80 or more hours per week and they are exhausted, but there's still no excuse for this error. Now, as you heard, Cobb County has taken responsibility for the error, but the ACLU is saying, look, you have taken responsibility for the error, but you're not doing anything. These people are going to be coming from out of town. It is ridiculous that you would say that they have to show up in person on such short, short notice. So the two civil rights organizations and the ACLU filed a lawsuit on behalf of the multiple voters affected and the local voter registration organization. They're asking the Cobb County Superior Court to provide emergency relief by overnighting the ballots to the remaining affected voters and extending the return deadline until November 15th when the, when the ballots from overseas are due in the state. ACLU staff attorney said that hundreds of eligible Cobb County voters did everything right and yet they find themselves on the brink of total disenfranchisement because they were never mailed their absentee ballot as required under Georgia law. Only this court can right the wrong done to these hundreds of voters and ensure that they are able to exercise their fundamental right to vote in the November election. And the lawsuit also asks that the court allow the voters to use their federal write-in absentee ballot, which provides over overseas voters a way to vote if their absentee ballot does not arrive in the mail on time. Players, this is just re damn ridiculous that a lawsuit had to be filed in the first place. Cobb County already has to wait on the military ballots to come in by November 14th. It's not inconveniencing them any to wait for those other voters. It's completely disgusting. I just don't understand why we have to fight about everything. This right here is a no-brainer. Players, Put your sentiments in the comments. Let me know what you're thinking. This is Double D Mobile, reporter for the Black Accurate News. Where I'm black, boy, the news is always petty, but accurate.